Welcome to Maryland, everybody. This weekend, I'm with my parents and we're going on a little mini vacation down to St. Michael's, Maryland. And this is a place that we love. We've come here a couple, many times, actually. Last year we came, I think, twice down here. And it's always got such a fun time. They have, it's a historic town on the Chesapeake Bay. They have a lot of really cute shops and restaurants and it's just always such a good time every time we come down here. So we're down for Father's Day weekend and we're going to the Maritime Museum because they have the antique and classic boat show that happens this weekend. So that's where we're heading right now. And we're about to, any second now, we're gonna start seeing the town. So we're so excited. And here's my parents, say hi. Hello. guys about where all the little shops and restaurants are and you can just tell all the homes here they were all built in like what 1700s most of them and yeah it's really pretty historic town to walk through oh and here it is Ava's this is you were gonna hear us talking about this a lot this weekend we love Ava's pizza love 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 it it reminds us very much of the pizza at Via Napoli in Italy at Epcot it is very similar to that thin crust pizza it is excellent we come here sometimes twice in one <laughs> one weekend trip Hi. Hi. <laughs> we just parked the car and now we are walking to the festival so we have we're not really sure where we're going we had to park in a lot we never were at before so now we're just kind of following our instincts we're like we see water that way so we're gonna go that way and <laughs> But it's actually really nice because this is kind of the residential side and you get to see all the pretty homes and the water's like right over that way. It's really nice. And we were saying, look how beautiful this sky is. It is like not a cloud in the sky. So mom and dad, are you ready? I'm ready. Yes. Dad, this is one of your favorite things. my favorite things to do. So what are you hoping to see at the boat show? Oh, all of the cool boats, all the old wooden boats. Yes. Everything's restored, it's beautiful. We're excited, let's go. Fried shrimp. Fried shrimp. It was really good. Was good. <laughs> so now we're gonna walk around and see all of the boats and see that they have a bunch of vendors set up and everything. So we're gonna go check it out. Classic boat, you need a classic car to tow it with. <laughs> yeah, here's their famous, this is like the icon of St. Michael's and the Maritime Museum, is this lighthouse. They restored it last year, remember? You couldn't go up, they yeah. couldn't go upstairs last right. year, but. Um, yeah, and was yeah. it, at one point it was a working lighthouse, correct? Oh yeah. I think so, yeah. yeah. It's pretty cool. <laughs> It's neat inside. Maybe we'll maybe we'll go up around. We'll venture up we'll in venture and see. Up. It's hot in there, but we'll go. Oh yes, it's hot. No air conditioning. <laughs> Me and my mom were saying we love this. Instead of the ice cream man, it is the ice cream lady. Look at that. Look, it's hot even it's Sunday. pink and everything. I love that. Lady working. Oh, that's true. That's very odd. It's not a lady. It's a man. Oh. 
in the ice cream lady truck. In the ice cream lady truck. <laughs> I wasn't expecting. You wouldn't think. <laughs> they have activities for the kids. You can paint a boat and such. I'm buying one of these glass pendants for Ben. I cannot pick. These are handmade. They are so beautiful. I can't decide which one's my favorite. So I made my decision. I got a really cool piece of art for Ben. And now we're going to go look at, this is the boat shop. And here, Dad, you would explain this better. <laughs> this is a working boat yard, a working repair shop that the museum has. And they have it here to educate people, to show them <laughs> what it was like, the old ways of doing things. and. They have a huge staff of volunteers that come down and they work on an old boat to restore it. Instead of tr trashing it, they restore it back to the way it used to be and they ha launch it out again. Sometimes they sell them. That's really awesome. Look, they have this thing they're hauling out. The canoe. This is really cool. So let's go inside and check out the boat shop. all the parts of the boat it's pretty awesome there's a different programs that you can come to and apprenticeship at oh that's really cool that's awesome i had no idea that they did that you can actually you can do apprentice that. here that's awesome and this is the original tools that they used to use basic woodworking tools but this is the tools of the trade My dad was explaining to me they're melting down raw lead and they're making an anchor for a boat, which is a looks like a very tedious process. <laughs> That's the cool thing about coming here is that, you know, it's like an attraction, but it's a real working shipyard at the same time. And a lot of people come here and you can dock your boat. And so since today's the festival, they have all the boats that are here and we can tour some of them and just look at, a lot of them are really beautiful and classic vintage boats, so it's awesome. And these ones over here are more like the yachts that they have. I got my smoothie, strawberry banana smoothie. It's very good, very tasty. And you guys are going to get your drinks. I'm going to get my, <laughs> yes, I think it's the Papa's. Uh, Arnold Palmer Arnold or something? Palmer. Yeah. yeah, that's what they're calling it. <laughs> <laughs> so let's head over this way. So here's like, to give you guys an overview of the festival. This right here was where I bought Ben his um, pendant, the glass blown pendant, and they have all these different vendors and stuff set up under that tent. And also along here, they have a bunch of tents and stuff. So here, these are, they're showing you all the things that you can find, like right here, that lives in this water that we're on. They have the horseshoe crab. We saw a lot of those last year when we were here at our hotel. Fish, you can see jellyfish, we've seen them here. Ducks, we just saw them back there. Crab, snakes, dad. Why do it have to be snakes? <laughs> This is my favorite exhibit here at the Maritime Museum because you can actually um, pull up crab traps and try to see if you caught a crab. And they also have eel there traps. Are. There they are. Those ones are fake, I think. No, they're not. Oh, really? These are real? Oh my gosh. I was thinking about the last time we were here. I think it was yeah. like off season and they didn't have them, but these are real. Okay, so I correct that. These are real crabs. Look at them. Yeah, that guy is massive over there. That one's a keeper. <laughs> He's a keeper. He's a keeper. The other ones you'd have to throw back. Like, he is really the keeper. This is so cool. Look the guys hiding back behind here. The two in the back are the biggest. He's pretty large. They are big. Wow. 
You see, this is what I was thinking of last time. These are the fake ones. And yeah, those the, over there are real. What's the trick that we learned? Oh, yeah, to we tell learned if they're a boy or girl. If they're a boy or girl, the females paint their fingernails. So anytime you see one that has red tips on it, that is the female one. The guys will have all blue, but the females will have red tips. Oh yeah, my dad's gonna pull the trap up for us and see if there's anything. If there's anything in it. Let's see. Thirty. Nope. Nothing. Nothing. <laughs> Nothing. I want to see my favorite thing to do is this thing right here. I don't know if we can do it because they have all the boats here. But try what you here. do, yeah, we can try it from the side. This is a oyster tong gear. Oyster tonging gear. That's how you say it. <laughs> and here, my dad will demonstrate how this works. This is my favorite thing to do. I could stand here and do this all day. Open it up. Get down in there. And then you clamp it together. And oh, he got something. Oh, Let's see what you got. Here. Oysters. Oysters. That is a lot. You grabbed a bunch. Yeah. Okay, Meg. Here I go. Here she goes. Let's see what she gets. It's it hard work. It is hard work. This is a good arm workout. That's what this is. <laughs> oh, I got some! Ah. All right. <laughs> there we go. We're eating good tonight. <laughs> <laughs> you want to do it, Mom? No, thanks. <laughs> <laughs> What do you think, guys? Can we catch an eel? I don't know. Let's see. Where's yeah, the, the other corner? side. Oh. We've done this a couple times here, and <laughs> never did we catch an eel. We've caught crabs, and we got oysters. I'll take the bag. But never an eel. So this would be an experience. Get him, just get him, just get him. <laughs> Anything in there? Mm, Hard to tell. Nope. Nothing. No, nothing. 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 In there. nothing. <laughs> beautiful. Very, very nice. Just spotted one of those snakes that they were talking about. He's all. He's, I don't know. I couldn't get the camera out quick enough, but he's in there. You can kind of see the water moving from him. <laughs> Papa Palmer. Papa Palmer. It is uh, a Palmer with rum, right? Arnold Palmer Ar with Arnold, rum. Yep. Very there you go. Arnold Palmer. <laughs> I may need this in my life. It is key lime pie on a stick covered in chocolate. Here's my favorite turtle. boat. Oh my gosh, there's a turtle. Oh, he's so pretty. That was so cool. This is my favorite boat. It's called the Sunburn. And it's like all red and white polka dot. It's kind of like Minnie Mouse. Wow. Big thank you to all the That's incredible. So this was the boat. That was it before. They revamped it. That's beautiful. Is there an upstairs? Do we go upstairs? There is. You can't go up. <laughs> you can look up there. You can kind of look up there. There's glass there. But... Here, I'll stick you guys around. Tell me what you see. <laughs> Frederick Douglass. He was from here in St. Michael's. Wow. And he changed his name to Douglas from Bailey to avoid capture when he escaped from slavery. Yeah, 
but so we just left the maritime museum for the festival <laughs> it was really fun it, it was, was awesome fun. we got to talking to some of the people and my dad made some boat friends and got to learn a lot about how they restore the boats and stuff like that so now we're heading into the town where they have a lot of the shops and things and we're gonna do some shopping <laughs> here you can see this is like kind of another central part of the town where they have all the boats docked we love this shirt because this is our cat at home mickey and this is ben's family cat looks just like this and it's like the two of them are together in one shirt <laughs> and coco i might break down and have to have that when we come back at christmas time <laughs> it's really cute mickey and coco so we're in the olive oil store olivens and they have vinaigrettes and a lot of great things that you can try and you can sample all of them it's so good we love this place they have look at all the different flavors that they have We just got to our room. We're staying at the Harbor Town Resort in St. Michael's and it is beautiful. I just showed the room tour and look at this. I'm on the balcony right now or our little deck thing out here and you have the bay right here and the thing that I'm really excited about is if you look right there that is that archway. They are going to be having a wedding in like a few hours right there so I'm really excited about that. We have front row seats to this wedding. I'm so excited. I love this hotel. We've stayed here pretty much all the time when we come down. This is always where we stay time and time again because it's just, it's awesome. And the view you just can't beat because look at that. It's beautiful. Oh my gosh, what is that? <laughs> Do you guys see that there's like, is that a rock or is it an animal? Let me see if I can zoom in. There's like a glare. Let me see. Oh yeah, do you guys see that? Look at that. It's not moving, but is it a rock? That's crazy. So here I'm gonna pan the camera. That's the wedding perception that's going on. So we actually, we think the wedding already happened for the day, but it happened right back there. Look at that. We would have had a front row seat. That's really cool. So we're about to head to the Crab Claw for dinner and we're all hungry. So we are excited to go get some awesome seafood and it's going to be an awesome night. This is pretty cool. We're here at the Crab Claw, and this shows you the full step-by-step -step of how to properly eat your crab. What you have to do. And then this is the life of the blue crab. We are the only people in this restaurant right now. The person up front said they were like slams like an hour or two ago, and now we're like the only people here. And look you guys, right over there, you see that like um, wood building? That is the um, boat shop that we went in earlier today. 
Was there a dog? Oh my gosh. I wonder if I can zoom with the screen, but there's a dog on that boat. <gasps> there he goes. And look, there's another dog. St. Michael's is a dog, dog town. It really is. Oh, He's like, we're going out on a cruise. Yeah, they have like a ton in the gift shops of shirts that say like it's a dog town and there's a ton of pet stores and different things. It really is like every, when we walk around, we see a ton of dogs, which I love. It just adds to the ambiance. You're on the bay and there's dogs. We're, yes, they do. They have dog menus at some of the restaurants. So bring your pets if you come here. It's a pet friendly town. So here's our meal. I got the crab cake. And I have a baked potato and green beans. And my dad, he got the same thing. He got a crab cake with a baked potato. And then he had a salad. And I mom, rockfish, rockfish tacos. <laughs> Indigenous to Eastern Shore, Maryland. It's kind of a local specialty. Yeah. Very good. <laughs> but you got a filet, a lot of bones. We're going to dig into this. It looks so good and it smells so good also. <laughs> We just got done dinner. It was awesome. We had a great meal. I had my crab cake. It was great. And we all really like what we got. Definitely recommend the crab claw if you are down here. Good morning. It is day two of our mini getaway vacation. Here's my mom. Hey, good morning. It's also Father's Day, so we just gave my dad all his Father's Day presents and he really liked them. So we give them to him out here on the balcony. And look at this view that we have. It is gorgeous. We got to watch. We just sat out here and had our coffee a little bit ago and it was so peaceful just to watch the boats go by and it was so nice. So now we're gonna call my grandfather and wish him a happy Father's Day. And then we're heading into town we're planning on going to the boat show again today and then also going to some of the shops and probably we're going to have lunch somewhere. So we haven't had breakfast yet so we're not sure if we're going to have breakfast or skip breakfast at this point but we'll figure it out as we go. It's kind of a day, it's all up in the air. but. <laughs> into the boat show for day two and we're gonna go check out the lighthouse because apparently they made some renovations to it since the last time we were here so we're gonna go see what they did look at the view from up here what are those logs for in the river or in the bay so my dad said they're softening them up and then they'll use them to make the boats as part of the thing. Sailing mats. Sailing mats. That's interesting. All right, let's go inside. Tippy top. Oh, look, you can go outside through this little thing. Oh my gosh! Yeah. Look at this right we now. Made it. It's hot. We made it. <laughs> yes. Oh wow, look at the boats coming in. Look at this. Look at this boat coming in. It's beautiful. Or yacht, I should say.
Hey, look at all the boats arriving. From up here you can see the entire Maritime Museum and see these are like the grounds. So right now for the festival or the boat show they have a bunch of boats set up and then they have vendors and different things, um, a lot of local artists underneath that tent there. And then year round you can come visit the museum and they have the museum, it's basically like it's outside but then they also have all these different buildings that you can go in and they you can see they have just the history of the Chesapeake Bay, history of crabbing and boating all that type of stuff so it's really a cool place and from up here you can see everything it's a boy <laughs> it's blue tips it's a boy i love how it says caution we bite <laughs> Like they're talking to you. Be bite. Oh, look, here's two back here. They're mean, too. Mm -hmm. <laughs> My brother was going like. Look, you guys, there's horseshoe crabs. Let's see if we can zoom in to the water. Do you guys see them? One of our favorites. My dad got as a starter, he got one of their meatballs. They are known for them here. They are really, really good. So we're all about to try it now. Dad, what would you rate the meatball? Very, very good. Very good. One of the best. <laughs> so our pizza is here. Here is the white cheese pizza. This is one of our favorites. And then our other favorite is the red pizza, which is a margarita pizza. We're about to head home right now, but we had the best little weekend getaway. It was awesome. Definitely check St. Michael's out if you are ever in the area or looking for a great getaway. Did you have it fun? Was, it was fun. Yes, it was fun. <laughs> Action. And it's St. Michael's, Maryland, not to be confused with St. Michael's, North Dakota. <laughs>